Hello, I'm Dionic, and welcome back to Let's Play Danganronpa. The audio got weird for some reason. Anyway, uh, so, we are talking to Kirigiri, I assume, is what we're supposed to be doing? Thanks, Kirigiri, it's all because of you. It's still too early to start celebrating. The real battle is still to come. Yeah, but, I mean, I guess, you know, you're not dead, so, so that's... That's something to celebrate, even temporarily. Yeah, I know. <sighs> but even so, I'm just relieved as- I'm just as relieved as you are. Thank goodness he accepted my proposition. But why do you think he did, anyway? What does the Puppet Master gain from accepting your challenge? <laughs> he had no choice. What? That's <laughs> That's what I was talking about when I said we had an advantage. Just wanted to make sure. So, in the end, what was the advantage? I didn't hear it firsthand. But the Puppet Master said that everything that happened here is being broadcast live nationwide over hijacked broadcast signals right it, yeah he did mm -hmm. what did you think when you heard that it was pretty hard to believe wasn't it what are you getting at lady well, yeah, him hijacking the broadcast signal seems almost unreal. So you. It seems unreal because it's something that doesn't happen very often. Because it's just that difficult. That but the Puppet Master pulled it off. Tonight. Turning that around, it means he had some reason he needed to do it, despite how difficult it was. A reason? So no matter the cost, he wanted to put us killing each other on display for the world to see. That was a blunt, brutal way of putting it, but that's exactly what's going on, right? He wanted to put us on <laughs> that, That's why I'm giggling to myself, because it's just, it's so ridiculous. He wanted to put us on display, killing each other. No, yeah. Puppet Master didn't just want us dead. He was determined to make us kill each other. He most likely established the school rules expressly for that purpose. Yeah, you're right. If those rules didn't exist, nobody would have killed anyone. Okay. Basically, the Puppet Master's objective was to make us kill each other and show that to the world. But, but to what end? So more than likely as proof. Proof? No. Do you know how Hope Academy students are referred to by the general population? Hope, right? So you. By plunging... By plunging us hope... Pl yeah, yeah. Us... What? By plunging us hope into the... Okay, alright. That was, that was just a weird way to say... Alright, whatever. Into despair and driving us to kill each other. And then putting that on display for the world. He wanted to prove that despair prevails over hope. That is the Puppet Master's goal. The Super Duper High School Despair's goal. Huh? To prove that the despair prevails over hope? All for something so stupid? So it is stupid, and it is logical, but... Illogical, rather. Not logical. The opposite of that. It's certainly something the group of people called Super Duper High School Despair would come up with. Okay. People who act purely for the sake of despair. A cult worshipping despair. But but making people suffer from, from something for, for something like that. There's no way in there. Now you can... I understand wanting to get angry, but it's because of that reason that our advantage was born. What? 
because the Puppet Master wanted to show us killing each other to the world. He's even more stringent than necessary about upholding the rules he established. Had he forced action, ignoring the rules, this would no longer be a coliseum, but a slaughterhouse. At the very least, that's how it would appear to the people watching. I mean, this is all stuff that, like, she literally said to Monokuma, like, last episode. So, I don't know why Negi's, like, not keeping up with it. So, that's why he couldn't kill us himself? So, yeah. That's the reason he couldn't kill me. With his own hands. As much as I was a thorn in his side, I wasn't actually breaking the rules. This... Okay! This is a weird flashback. So he couldn't step in and intervene directly like he did with Esohina. Enoshina. In Enoshima! He attempted to kill me using that class trial, so it would appear as though he was upholding the rules. That was no correct answer. There was no correct answer. Whatever, my, my sleepy brain's still trying to get turned on. I mean that in a sexy way. Uh, so it's... So I'm, I'm really bad right now. I apologize. Just a step to make me into the culprit. Just a setup to make me into the culprit. Whatever. But he failed! Son. All thanks to you. And from that failure, we gained an even bigger advantage. He tried to execute you, even though you were innocent. And since his failure was revealed on live television, he had no choice but to accept your proposal. Uh. To prove to the world that despair prevails over hope, he needed to completely and utterly defeat us. Somebody. So, the revelation of the Puppet Master having violated his own rules was a mark against him. And you used that against him to get, in to get him to accept your challenge. Yeah, okay, we already did all of this. <laughs> like, what? There's no... I don't know why all of this is here. Like... Alright, whatever. It was you who put that hole in his defenses. We're only walking this route now because you believed in me. I... I can't believe you figured all that out. I hadn't noticed anything. No, I just reasoned it out without any solid proof and took a chance on the right on the reasoning <sighs> thankfully it appears i was right after she said that she let on a deep breath like a weight had been lifted from her shoulders <laughs> quite frankly i haven't been that nervous in a while that's not how it looked to me before we left to find Monokuma, you looked like you were brimming with confidence. <laughs> That's one of the fundamentals of negotiation. Negotiation. You need to be strong and sure of yourself. Besides, if I look anxious, it would have been just... It would have just made you even more so. She's probably right about that. As pitiful as it makes me. That kid but we can't just sit here clamoring about how happy we are forever. Now we've attained all we've attained now is a chance to continue fighting. If we don't win here, then it will have all been for nothing. Yeah. She's right. If we don't beat the puppet master here, we can't make it out of here alive. Winning is our only option. No. Or losing. Before we begin our final investigation, we need to bring the others up to speed. But we know who our enemy is now. So all that's left is for everyone to work together and hunt down the Puppet Master. Everyone working together. Then. Will it really be that easy? Huh? Ah, uh, well, Togami will make it hard, I believe. Tonikaku. Anyway. We need to find everyone else. Let's go. I'm sure there's somewhere in the dorms. Okay. Alright. 
Yeah. Alright, so I should be able to put on my little thingy. Go run over here to the dormies. Running around at the speed of slow. Something about following my rainbow. Alright. Go, go in! Go in! Yeah, okay. Alright. Uh, so what? They're just here somewhere? Are they in their rooms? Seems silly. If I have to go to every individual room? Don't make me go to their rooms. Really? Alright. I guess that's what we're doing. We're going to their rooms. Oh, unless maybe they're at the Capitorium. I guess I need to check my actual map. I don't know why they wouldn't show up on, like, the easy map. What? Okay, well, is this Curie's here somewhere? But apparently not. Alright, let's go knock on their door. Alright, we will start with... Not Kiri, not Negi, not Awada, not Meizono, ah, uh, sure, Togami. This is Togami's room, I wonder if he's inside. Thud thud. Wee. Thud thud. Wee. No. Doesn't look like he's here. Let's look elsewhere. Let's look else. okay, well, the Capitorium, probably. That, that would be my guess. Hello, Cavatorium. Waiting for us in the Cavatorium when Kirigiri and I arrived was... <laughs> DS! Fr <laughs> DS! Front Slash! Semicolon R O D B X V Z six. Some kind of lines? It's not really an equal sign. B R A dash plus. Or sorry, my minus sign plus sign. I comma seven S quotation Q C yen D M four question mark A M forward slash. EXP exclamation. You again? Uh, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not, I'm not doing it. I don't care. You're a gang, you're a rat, 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 Oh, Curie! Oh! Red Zab, Red Zab, Seven, Red Zab, Red Why? And he's gone now. Demo. Thank God for that. I wonder what that was about. I barely had time to let out a sigh before. What? Nagi! Nagi, is that you? Oh, right! This is- I was like, why are they all freaking out? But no, it's the first time they see you after you were murdered. Murdered. How? Oh. Guys! It really is you! I can't believe my eyes! It's Negi! Uh, oh, you're alive? I swear, you're as resilient as a damn cockroach. Just to be sure, you're not a ghost, are ya? There everyone was, my friends, my companions, the people I had fought alongside. The moment I saw everyone's faces, my eyes got a little misty. Wait, what's that stench? It's- it's me and the trash queen. 
Oh, damn, dude, that's rank. <laughs> it's Neggy. Neggy smells like a wet dog. I slept. I slept. I slept in a pile of trash for like at least a day. Go, go stand over there. Sh shoo. Really? Really? Really, Fukawa? Really? We're, we're gonna go, we're gonna we're gonna talk about my smell. Really? <sighs> and with that, the tears receded. Nagi, we don't have time to turn this into a heartfelt reunion run. Well, they don't want that either. They want me to stand on the other side of the room so they can't smell me. We need to tell everyone what happened with Monokuma. Nanda. Monokuma, what about him? Hmm? By the way, you're gonna be all right, Megs? You're a fugitive now. It'd be bad if the puppet master found you. So. That too was to do with what we need to tell everyone. All right, all right. <laughs> what we need to tell you has to do with the final class trial. <laughs> the final class trial? <laughs> We're retrying Makuro Ikasawa's murder case. <gasps> huh? We're retrying it. No, not Retry it once or a thousand times, dude. Neg still did it, didn't he? No. That's what everyone- That's what we're saying! It wasn't me. Negi did not murder her, of course. Neither did I, nor did any of you. Huh? No, then, who did? It's the Puppet Master's doing. Huh? Huh? You're saying the Puppet Master killed Makuro Ikasaba, or not? So. Yes. It was all an elaborate trap laid out by the Puppet Master. Negi discovered that trap, and he tried to prevent it from going off. And because of that, he was sentenced to execution. Negi discovered the trap, you say? See, like, if we were going to talk about, like, everything that had happened, why didn't we do it here? Why didn't we do it, like, in front of these people? Why, why didn't we just, you know... To just do that whole little oh you saved my life sort of thing in front of them because at least then it would serve a purpose right i think it's here with the trap you say i wasn't nearly as conscious of it as you're making me out to be but that's cool Demo. however the act of executing negi was who was not the culprit is a blatant violation of the rules the school rules say the villain will be executed. In other words, the Puppet Master broke his own rules. <laughs> so, we negotiated with him, asked him to grant us a retrial. <gasps> and he did? Just because he broke a rule, he wrote himself? <laughs> he had no choice but to agree. He used that... <laughs> Speaking of breaking rules they write themselves, like, I feel like YouTube and, uh, and everyone who, or uh, whoever owns YouTube, uh, UMD keeps claiming, like, all of my videos. And so, like, uh, apparently there's a problem with, uh, Universal Media, uh, uh, claiming videos that they have no rights to at all as well. And there's nothing anyone can do about it. So, so that, so that resonates with me right now. He had no choice but to agree. You used that broadcast signal hijacking against him, didn't you? So. We're on the same wavelength, I see. Who's in the... You mentioned something at the end of the last class trial. When you said, it's the Bubba Master who'd been cornered. This is what you meant, isn't it? Kineda? Hey, you're leaving me in the dust here. Huh. If you can't keep up, then ask Kiri Gary or someone to explain things to you later. So, so then, what are we supposed to do now? We just need to show that it was the Puppet Master who killed Makuro Ikasaba, right? Surely that's not all, is it? No, it's not. Monokuma said that for us to win this trial, we need to solve all the ac academies. Mysteries. A academy. That's how I want to pronounce it. Mysteries, too. 
all of the academy academies. I'm gonna read it from. I'm gonna read it that way from now on. Academies mysteries. Demo. See that? That's what happens when I don't stop myself and like stutter a little bit. I read things like that. Whatever. We'll ignore it happened. You mean the stuff we've been investigating all this time and still haven't learned hardly anything about? Tonikaku. Probably all suspect as much already. But if we lose, then all of us will be executed. <laughs> we'll all be executed? <laughs> Hold on. Don't you go around making challenges like that without our consent. Uh, I'm perfectly fine with the way things are, as long as my white knight is here with me. And I'd like to get out of here as soon as possible. Anyway, our chance of surviving is to uncover the truth. <laughs> Which is to say, this is the deciding battle. What an interesting development. But we've got to do that on top of figuring out who the puppet master is and how he committed the murder. <sighs> Our plate just keeps getting bigger and bigger, dude. But hey, unlike the other class trials we've had, we know exactly who our enemy is this time. So if we all work together, I'm positive we can figure this out. I'm not so sure about that. Huh? <laughs> I personally cannot concur with the proposal that everyone work together. <laughs> Why not? We're obviously better off working together if we want to solve the Academy's mysteries. <laughs> I, of course, thought the same thing. Until Monokuma said, until he said... <laughs> Actually, while we're on it, I'll give you one more hint. I'm sure I've mentioned this before, but there are a total of 16 participants, all of whom are students, and this is a academic coliseum. Also, since the coliseum commenced operation, the only living human to set foot in the academy are those very same 16 students. <laughs> I see. If that's what Monokuma says, then Kirigiri's exactly right. <laughs> huh? Why? Because it means that one of you guys are the murderer, maybe. Assuming, as Kirigiri said, it was the puppet master who killed Makuro Ikasaba, that means he's inside Hope Academy. The murder the murderer is one thing. The murder is one thing! But tampering with the crime scene to that extent with Monokuma is nigh impossible. <laughs> However, based on what Monokuma said, the only living humans to have set foot in the academy. Okay, okay, this is all well and fine and good and all of that. But what the hell happened to Monokuma? Like, remember when Monokuma was just, like, laying on the floor all... What was that a part of the trap? Like, disassembled and took the bomb out of and... and What does that mean? However, based on what Monokuma said, the living human has had the academy. Are the 16 students participating in this academic coliseum? <laughs> then the puppet master's identity... Is one of us. There are 15 people in the entrance hall on the first day. A add Makuro Ikasaba and you get 16. <laughs> so he's one of those 16? So. Furthermore, of those 16, only the six of us are still alive. I believe you can figure the rest out from there. <laughs> you mean one of us is the puppet master? <laughs> No way! Uh, hold on! We can't be certain of that just yet. Makuro, or sorry, Monokuma! <laughs> Whatever, they're the same person, maybe, I don't know. Monokuma could have just said that to freak us out. It is possible, yes, but 
it's only one of many possibilities. Also, he already broke one rule. What's to say? What, what's to stop him from breaking another rule? What, what, what's to say that he hasn't already broken another rule? The same is the possibility of the Puppet Master being in this room. <laughs> so long as the possibility exists, it cannot be ruled out. Uh, I agree. When the title Super Duper High School Despair came to life, it became pretty clear that the Puppet Master was a student. We can't deny that he could be among us. Or she. I mean, they're, they're all saying, and I haven't said this in a while, but they're all saying he, but it could very likely be female. But if one of us really was the puppet master, then why rather then would then they would have to control Monokuma too. And yet, in all the times Monokuma showed up, no one has ever acted that suspicious, have they? Yeah, they could have just snuck away and done it. One of us would have would have noticed someone sneaking away so many times. Unless they were a ninja, or Makuro Ikasaba that we've never actually even seen. So, then Monokuma's completely a atomic. A automatic? Yeah, automatic. Autom yeah. Dude, everything he says and does is all profit Program prop prop a crack crab If that were the case, he wouldn't be able to hold such natural sounding conversations. <laughs> if someone were able to guide it, well, okay. So they say that, but the AI that we had, um, Alter Ego, was capable of having conversations. If someone were able to guide it, though, through conversation, it's certainly not impossible. So, sure, I guess, but but let's be honest. Ding dong, ding dong. Uh, May I have your attention, please? Sure. As I expect you guys are already aware. Our academic coliseum is rapidly entering its final chapter, wherein all will be revealed. Yay! In the spirit of fairness, I've opened all the locks in the building. Investigate as much as you'd like. Solve mysteries to your heart's content. Oh, boop, boop. See you at the class trial. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? <laughs> uh, how very generous of him, unlocking every door, even though we have the device to unlock every door. <laughs> the time for chit chat is over. Now we investigate. But, but, <laughs> I was planning to work my by myself regardless. <laughs> this late in the game, all I can rely on is myself and the Togami blood cur coursing up through my veins. <laughs> You shouldn't concern yourself with others, either. Just do what you need to do. Jana. Goodbye. I mean, that actually feels like a sound, like, way to do things, right? Having said that, Togumin quickly left the cafetoria. Ooh, my white knight! He, he didn't take me with him. Oi, oi. Of course he didn't, dude. <laughs> Not my white knight around. You are all like a cappuccino. You are all like a cappuccino with neither coffee nor milk. It, in other words, worthless to me. All right. So, so goodbye. And with that, Fukawa to slithered out of the cafetorium. Well, there she goes. You're planning to fly solo too, Kiri? Oh. Yes. Mm. Which means just Nags and Hina are left. Mm. Alright then, going alone's the best option. Yeah, what 
the hell is that supposed to mean? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? No, nothing. You just watch, dude. Me and my crystal ball are going to blow the lid off this whole thing. Ha 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 bellowing laughter filled the room and slowly faded away as he left the cafetorium. Aw, everyone really is going off by themselves. What are you going to do, Asahina? Hmm. I guess I'll see what I can do on my own, too. Don't get me wrong. It's not because I don't trust everyone, you know? It's just, never really been any help before. I always relied on Sakura and everyone else. You've been no help. That's not true at all. You've been here. Uh, you being here has been a huge help. N Negi. Aw, you're too kind. But it's true that I haven't been very useful. Yes. At the very least, I want to try my best and find something of value now, while I have the chance. So, I'm gonna go in, go it alone too. <laughs> Having said that, I'll catch you later. Asina dashed out of the cafetorium. And the only one left... One's left? It was you! <laughs> it's just me and you again. <laughs> oh, I thought Kiri already left! What are you doing here, Kiri? This is awkward. Yes, indeed. Okay. So, we're going to, I guess, do our investigation next episode. For now, we're going to go ahead and end this here. Um, yeah, so hopefully a lot of stuff... Well, everything's supposed to be revealed, right? So, I'll find out, like, all of the deep, dark secrets of the Academy and all of that very soon, I hope. Um... Yeah, I, I don't know if we're actually going to end up traveling with Kiri or what's going on with that. I guess we'll find that out, too. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Leave a like, comment on what you think of the game. Go check out the other videos I've done. I will see you soon. Just a jar full of oregano. It's weed. It's weed. Weed? Like cannabis? Yes. Yep. There's a lot of it in there. Yep. Oh, and it stinks. Yep. Do you smoke this stuff, Joe? Yep.